Hello everyone, my name is Nomus, and welcome back to another episode of The Long Dark. We are picking up here, back at the, uh, the Lonely Lighthouse, where we left off last time around. Uh, just wondering what we should do today. It sounds like... Uh, well, it did sound like it was a bit windy outside, but maybe that's calmed down now. Yeah, sounds kind of calm now. So I think we're going to head out and uh, head down the highway, do a little bit more exploring of this area. Just going to see uh, if there's anything we should drop off. We should be eating some food, though, before we head out. So let's eat an energy bar. Get our calories up here. And maybe we'll have some uh, condensed milk as well. We might want to bring something else with us to eat. Oh, that condensed milk actually gives us quite a bit. 750 calories. So we still have one of those on us, plus an energy bar. We might be fine. we got lots of fluids. Okay, I think we're good for food. Uh, what's our weight at? 27. There must be some stuff we can drop off, though. We can drop off both of these. We don't need to carry those, because they're spent. We can... Let's see here. Those probably weighed a bit. We could drop off this newspaper, I guess. And this leather. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just drop that stuff here. We can organize that later. Drop the newspaper. Drop that piece of coal. We'll sort that stuff out later. Yeah, we don't need all this cloth. We'll keep a few pieces on us, but I think that's probably about all we need to keep for now. Uh, yeah. I think we look good. Do we want to keep our hacksaw here? We haven't used it yet. Let's um, let's just drop that for now too. And I'll just put the hacksaw up there. And yeah, we'll sort that stuff out later. Let's head down to the front door. We did take a bit of damage uh, last episode from a wolf attack, but we are back up to 100% after our sleep. So we're gonna try this again. Let's see, we've got uh, 13 hours of daylight, good. This is a nice morning. Ooh, I like the light today. Hopefully, we don't run into that wolf again. But he was just up here, so. Keep an eye out for him. Uh, it feels like mine is 16, so we won't be able to stay out for too long right now unless it warms up a bit as the day progresses. Hope that I really hope that wolf isn't around here. So I guess we'll um, let's see. There was a, we saw a house kind of up in the woods or the roof of a house, so we'll check that out. We can find where that was. And you can see our blood from the last episode. We were attacked right over here. Yeah, so there's a building up there. It's like it looks like it's a church. I see a cross up on the roof. Thank goodness. Made it through another night. Yes, you did, ma'am. You sure did. We've survived for five and a half days. Pretty good. Pretty good. We're about a, is that a, about a quarter or the fifth of the way to our longest attempt at survival. Okay, we've already searched that apparently. Going up here. It's another branch up here we could harvest for some more firewood. Actually, a couple. All right. Was it to the left or the right? The church. Let's see here. Not there. Oh, it's right up here, hey? There it is, right there. Okay, we got some rabbits up here. That's good to know. We can set up a, a snare or two. Lots of branches to harvest. And lots of sticks to pick up. That's good to see. Alright, what we got here is Stone Church. Ooh, someone died while making a prayer. 
What do you got for medical supplies? Give me some more bandages. End up being useful. We need more bandages. Some gloves on the bench there. Don't really need those. We got a good amount of cloth right now. Okay, a little bit more tinder. Oh, there we go. A box of rifle ammunition. Some sardines. A can opener. Nice. Mm, this will come in handy. Haven't found one of those yet. Our sleeping bag. Uh, I might keep that cedar firewood here in case we need to come back up here and start a fire. What we got underneath here. Another hunting knife. Okay. I'll leave the bedroll there. Just so we know that we have some things to come back to and stay out here if we needed to for some reason. Let's harvest these mushrooms. Okay. Anything we can do back here? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, that's a pretty cool location though. Nice design. Alright, sticks. Uh, Alright, we are getting pretty cold though. We might need to head back to the lighthouse and warm up. Um, I'm tempted to get some of this wood though. Let's see, what is it? Minus 14. It's starting to get a little bit warmer. Let's harvest this one. Let's break that down. And yeah, we're starting to freeze now, so... I'll take this back. We'll warm up. So cold. Yeah. I'm warming up a bit. Alright, don't worry, don't worry. We'll go get warmed up as soon as I can find a way down from here. Just go back the way we came. Oh, can't go through there. We could just start a fire here, but I think we've we've got enough time to make our way back down. Uh, not down there. That's too steep. Well, we got some more firewood down, so that's good. Found a few supplies up at the church. All right, let's get down. Uh, condition is dropping kind of quickly. Yeah, it did get a bit colder while we were harvesting that branch. Oh, and there's Mr. Wolf. There's our friend Mr. Wolf. Okay, let's hold on here. He's looking around. Let's see if he heads down there. If he heads down towards the ice, we'll just make a run for it, I think. Which I think he is. Alright, we're gonna have to make a dash. Let's see if we can run by him. Ready? Let's go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. We've got a little bit of energy left here. We'll sprint as long as we can. I think we made it though. Yeah, I think we're good. Okay. Whew. Let's uh let's make sure we always have a little bit of sprint in our bar when we see a, a wolf nearby. So it might just be enough to save us from another attack. Maybe I should have tried to sprint out away from the last time. Instead of using the torch. Although I think if the torch would have stayed lit, probably could have scared him off. Or else why would they give you the option to uh, swing your torch about? Alright, let's holster this. Um, we want to drop off this wood. So I think we got all our cedar wood over here. So let's drop this off. There we go. Head over to the cupboard. Put our mushrooms in there that we picked up. There we go. Put that in there. Uh, the crow feather. 
Keep that stuff on us. Old man's beard. We'll keep that on us. All right, let me just take a quick look at our medical supplies. We got three bandages. Bunch of antiseptic. I think we could keep some of this antiseptic out here. So we don't really need all that stuff on us. Um, yeah, let's just drop both of these. Free up even a little bit more space. Put them both up there. Oh, where did the other one go? Down here. Okay. And I guess we'll need to uh, sleep for a little bit so we can warm up. So we'll do that. Uh, we'll just sleep for two hours. That should be enough to warm us up. Get a little bit of our condition back. We got about eight hours left of daylight. All right, well, up to 87%, not quite as high as I thought we'd get. So let's... Um, Let's go with three hours. Let's see where that puts us. We'll have to eat and drink. So those levels were getting kind of low. 96, okay, that's pretty close. All right, let's have some of these peaches. Use our brand new can opener. Save our hunting knife. I guess we could drop off this other hunting knife too. Sounds pretty windy out there. Drink that. Might not be going back out today. Kind of sounds too cold. Want to drop off this extra hunting knife. Uh, this one, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's too cold. That's too cold. So, let's take this uh, cloth. Let's pick this stuff up again. We're going to put this, I think, in a cupboard. Since it's quite a bit of it. We'll resort all this stuff now. Since it's going to be cold. So, let's use these up here, these lockers. Drop most of the stuff in here. That. We can break down these newspapers. Kill some time. My guess is we'll just be inside for the rest of today. It might be a bit warmer in the morning. Uh, the coal can go downstairs. Tinder plugs. Yeah, we'll keep all those on us. Do any of our clothes need to be repaired? Let's throw a little bit into our toque here. Oh, we can't. We need uh, we need a new sewing kit, eh? Hey? All right, let's get another sewing kit. Actually, we got one up here. Matches. Didn't we put one up here? Maybe not. I thought we did. Oh well. I know we have a bunch down on the table down here. Um, pretty sure we do. Back. Like that. There we go. We got a ton of them. Okay. Let's pair that a little bit. Good. Might as well repair the mittens too. Get those up to 100%. And I guess the boots would be next to repair, but we can do that later. I guess I could put this stuff in the uh, medicine cabinet, hey? Since we have one. Any other medicines we want to put in there? We got 42 painkillers, we probably don't need all those. Let's put half of them in there. And 
and same with the antibiotics. Okay. Alright, let's just see how cold it is. It sounds pretty cold, but let's take a... Oh yeah! It's only minus 7 though. Minus 9, minus 10. It's actually not quite as cold as it seems. Let's just experience this blizzard for a bit. Might as well appreciate the work that went into uh, designing the weather systems. It's pretty cool. Alright, let's head back in. So we've got four hours of daylight left. Um, what do we want to do, guys? Don't really have any food to cook up. I guess we could boil some water. Maybe let's do that. Let's start a fire here. With, uh, just with this. Yeah, let's do that. And, uh, yeah, we'll boil some water in, in preparation of the time when we do run out of water. We got enough for now, but eventually we will go through it. And the more fires we start, the higher our skill will go, so... Always good to get some practice in. Sounds like it may have calmed down out there now. So let's do two liters. Getting a bit thirsty ourselves. 19 minutes, okay, we'll just boil what we can here. Okay, we were able to boil um, all of it there. That's all right. Down to embers. Where should we put this water? Just keep it by the door. Uh, we can put it up uh, on the shelf here. Let's move these matches over. So we'll go. We'll drop some of this water. Let's drop two liters. What we just made. And we'll drop, well, I guess we only have 15 matches. We'll keep those on us. All right, where's that water? Water bottle. Let's put that there. And I can't see, there we go. All right, sounds a lot uh, better outside now. Two hours of daylight. Hmm. Alright, that wolf is down on the ice. Let's, uh, I don't know. It's not very much time. But it is warm. Let's go for it. Let's run down the road. I can't see where that wolf is. Let's push down the road, see what we can find. If anything, maybe we can find another house. Somewhere to sleep in for the night. We can continue searching in the morning. Alright, I'm just gonna walk. Get some of our stamina back. So I think that road just goes up to the church. Let's stick to the highway here. I think that just loops around to the church. Yeah. So this is the bridge that we saw from the ice. When we were heading over to the Riken. Looks like there's a body, must be a body down there. That's a cool waterfall. It's a pretty big one. I think one of the biggest ones we've seen. There's also a fairly big one, I think, 
in the uh, ravine between the Coastal Highway and Mystery Lake. Alright, so that's where we were last, uh, where we left the last episode and where we looted the episode before that. We got a bridge up ahead. So probably something else up there. It's minus one. Let's just eat a uh, granola bar here, get a few more calories in us. We've got, we're still at two hours of daylight, so should be able to make it to a location. We can always hop back in there if we needed to. All right, we got a bit of sprint here. Let's just uh, push forward. Let's check out this outpost. Maybe get some more bandages, painkillers. There we go, bandage, awesome. And more antibiotics. Cloth there, not interested. Um, I'll just take a quick peek in here. Is there a rifle, you think? No. A bit of food, we can come back for that. Let's keep pushing. Keep pushing while the weather's nice and uh, we got a little bit of daylight left. So there's a pathway going up there. Okay. Oh, no, that's a bear. That's a bear. Okay, not going that way. Nope. No, thank you. Going up here today. Just lumbering down the road. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, looks like we've got another mine here. Okay. This would be a decent place to sleep. Abandoned mine number five, the east access. I think the last one we were in to get to Desolation Point was uh, mine number four. Good, another flare. Okay, do we have any lantern fuel on us? I should have picked some up before we left. I don't think we do. Okay. Uh, we're going to save our flares. Oh, I don't know. This isn't going to give us much light to explore this really thoroughly. It's gonna follow the wall, I think. Maybe we'll come across another stash of supplies, like right here. We get lucky and find uh, some lantern fuel or a jerry can. More matches. Or even a fire barrel where we can uh, make ourselves another torch. Okay, let's keep going down here. Oh my god, it's dark. Tempted to use a flare, but I'd rather save those for the uh, animals. Is this a dead end? Oh god. The groans. Yeah, we could easily get lost down here. I don't know. Oh, I might break down and use a flare, guys. I have no idea where we're going right now. Okay. Lots of coal. Alright, that's a dead end, is it? Pretty sure that's a dead end. Yeah, that's a cave in. Okay. Let's head back. More coal. We can find our way out of here. Ooh, we're probably almost through our wood matches now. We down to just cardboard matches and oh, okay, a little bit of a drop there. One more. I 
feel like we've gotten turned around. All right, I'm using a flare, guys. I need to find our way out of here. <laughs> Probably should have just gone back and got some lantern fuel. We're gonna go through so many, uh, uh, matches to find our way out, so might as well just use a flare. Make it a bit quicker. We still have two left, so. Well, we got lots of coal. We should try and uh, use that furnace. Maybe in the next episode. All right, we're back at the. All right, so that's there. Let's just let's see if there's anything else back here. If we miss a turn off, maybe. Maybe this is just a small mine. Take a quick look. This flare should last for a while, so. Let's see if there's anything we missed back here. As we were stumbling around. No, I don't, I don't think so. I think we went as far as we. Oh no, there's a, there's a turn off here. Oh, excellent, here we go. Another exit. Desolation point. Okay. Alright, so there is another entrance. It's more pop. One lantern fuel. This stuff will come in handy. Scrap metal. Awesome lantern fuel. Yes. Success. Lots of coal there. Okay, let me just check this other option. I think this is where we went. Yeah, that was the dead end. Okay. Okay. Well, should we poke our head out? Let's see where this takes us to? The West Access. Uh, not that cold. I don't think I'll be venturing out. Let me just take a look around here. Got some sort of burned out building here. Or is this the church? Okay. Okay, good to know. Well, I think we're just going to sleep in the mine tonight, guys. And uh, we'll continue doing some more exploration next episode. So we've got a, uh, a good kind of shortcut to get to uh, the other side by the... Uh, like a safe shortcut without wolves to get to the processing plant, uh, which is good to know. Yeah, let's just uh, set up our bedroll in here uh, for tonight. Or better all down because it is pretty warm in here. We'll eat some more food. Uh, have a pop. Have this energy bar, I think. There we go. And yeah, I think we'll pick up again next episode. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. We got to see a few new locations today. Keeping that uh, uh, a few new or a few new locations each episode so far, which is nice. Leave me a comment below if there's uh, anywhere uh, in the nearby vicinity we should check out. Just point me in a direction. We'll head there next episode. Hit that like button if you enjoyed. And until next time, I'll talk to you all later. Uh -huh.